Hey everybody, I'm back here today. It's uh, Valentine's Day, so I'm going to make something for me and Mom um, in the smoker. So, uh, let's get started. I got my, my little cuz, little John, with me on the on the set today. He's um, he going to be my cameraman. So, uh, yeah, let's get started here. This is kind of similar to uh, what we've been doing is our salmon growl blocks. Um, but I'm doing a quick cure on these. So what you need is 50-50. 50% 50, 50, uh, salt, 50% sugar. And I'm going to go ahead and put some on the bottom. Like that. Got some uh, Atlantic salmon fillets. Put some salt on top. Salt and sugar. Nice. Or brine. This one on top of there. And what I'm going to do is I have a smaller Pyrex container. I'm going to fill it with water and that'll do our press. So that'll help this process get a little faster uh, by curing it and squeezing out this water. And uh, next step is uh, just we're going to boil some potatoes. Yeah, there you go, cameraman. Uh, we'll, I'm going to boil some potatoes and um, probably make potato cakes and a salad on the side. So I think this is going to be a good dinner. Stay tuned. All right, well, while we got the potatoes boiling, I'm going to go ahead and make ourselves uh, just a lemon dill sauce. I'm going to put in a little sour cream here. Go with some dill. And some lemon juice. And give it a stir. Let's see what we're looking at. You know, you know, either you want it a little runny or a little thick, it's all depending on how you want it. Uh, that's looking about right. I think we can put a little more dill in. Not much, but just a little. That's the way it's looking. Yep. That'll do. Alright, now I'm just going to set this in the fridge until later tonight. Alright, so what I've done is already started mashing these. I forgot to do the camera again. Um, but I did about, I don't know, about a quarter cup of uh, half and half. We'll do a half a stick of butter right in there. That's going to make it just absolutely great. And that's how you want to do your traditional mashed potatoes for sure. Some cream and butter. We'll just get this butter all incorporated. And now you can add your uh, salt. I did add salt to the boil when I was boiling it. Uh, you can add granulated garlic. A lot of people do that. And uh, these were red potatoes. I usually leave the skins on, but we're going to make potato cakes. So I didn't know how that would bind as well. So let me get this stirred up. All right, y'all. So this is pretty much what it's going to look like. Um, it's got a lot of water to it out of this brine. Brime. But, um, what you'll do is, uh, go ahead and rinse this off, and we're going to put it in the smoker, and what I'm going to do is a, uh, uh what I'm going to do is I'm going to crack the door on my, uh, smoker. Uh, I've got one of those, uh, master builds electric smokers. And I'm going to go ahead and put uh, some pecan wood in there, pecan, whatever. Apple wood would work. I have that, so I might do a little mixture. And um, <clears throat> have that door cracked and have it at as high as it'll go, which I think the, uh, the model I have will go to 275. Um, but now it is like dumping snow right now so it's gonna be a little tricky to keep it 
real high but we want that smoke to it so um, I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then uh, we'll start making these uh, potato uh, potato cakes right after that all right so I'm gonna start on these uh, potato cakes a little bit of flour A bit of, I'd say a little less than a third of a cup. We got two beaten eggs, and mainly this is pretty much you just need to stir it to find out your consistency of, uh, of what's going on here. So, let me stir this for a little bit. So, pretty much, um, I'd say almost a third of a cup of flour to, and two beaten eggs to about eight medium sized uh, red potatoes. So, all I'm going to do, <laughs> stuttering, sorry. Um, all I'm going to do is going to go ahead and form these into just potato cakes and um, I got my oil going in this pan here and we're just going to fry them up so give me a few seconds and magic will happen alright so got quite a few of these little yum potato cakes in here so I, I think they take about five minutes per side um, you know well what else is good is this right here so happy Valentine's Day to everybody and uh, we'll be back here in a few minutes all right so I just ran out in the snow check on the um, smoker it's doing really good um, like I said I got that door open pretty well eh, two and a half three inches wide um, just flip the potato cakes it smells so good in my house so all I'm gonna do is wait for everything to get ready now I'm definitely drinking beer so I'll be back all right, all right. Well, we got our potato cakes. I shredded up some of that smoked salmon. Put it right on top. Then some of that lemon and dill salt. one time heck yeah so I'm gonna take this up to mom real fast man it's one time so uh, thanks for watching y'all and uh, we'll see you next time